got a brand new printer. And while I was away at King of the Hammers, George and Tony and their friend Mikhail set up this giant Elegoo printer and they've been going crazy with printers. We got a Bamboo Lab mini something, whatever it's called. So we've got snakes, we've got rockets, more rockets, bigger rockets. So they've been going crazy with printing and Tony said he left me a big surprise in the lab. But before that, let's show you how it all went down. You got it. Oh. I got it. <laughs> Oh, little baby roll. <laughs> wow. It's just regular head, but... This is very professional. This is just basic, right? Oh. Is this the top, bottom? No, it's again, it's gonna go up and down. Uh. <laughs> yeah, the bed stays, right? Yep, bed stay underneath, so it's, it's gonna go on the Z-axis. Yep. Uh, mm. That's what it looks like with the holes? Mm -hmm. <sighs> Workout. Okay. So you didn't miss out you didn't miss out on your workouts. <laughs> oh my god. Oh my god. It's so <laughs> Good thing you've been working out. I'm out of you. <laughs> okay. Wow. This is not your average 3D printer.
Look what we got this time, or George got this time on one of his late night web crawling adventures. Look at the size of this thing. This is the Elegoo something big model. So a regular 3D printer will take this one kilogram, is that what they are? Yeah, one kilogram spool. This one takes five kilograms. Look at that. This has an 800 millimeter by 800 millimeter by 1000 millimeter print capability, which is about 31 by 31 by 39 in, in inches. So it can print half of me at this, and then the other half in two sittings. That's insane. And speaking of that, because I am about to head out to King of Hammers to help Rudy, we're gonna 3D scan me and print a stand-in for me so when I'm gone, I don't have to be all the way gone. All right, so the 3D scanner can't pick up, pick up dark colors very well. So since my beard is a little on the dark side, I gotta powder it like George Washington there. Do I look like an old man yet? I don't think any more will stick in there. I'm at capacity. wanted to give everybody a little bit of an update. We're printing Mini Trevor, and it's been printing for 83 hours and 38 minutes. And there's four hours and 24 minutes or so left. That stuff around him is support. It's called tree support. So it spans up from the bottom to help support the overhangs, like his arm, his head, his neck. All that stuff and if you look down there it's got even little tree support supporting his pant leg it is turning out amazing Trevor, good boy. Let's check this thing out. What in the world? What in the world? Does it look just like me? That's ridiculous! Tony, why would you do such a thing? Speeding image. Now that's a real white boy. <laughs> Holy crap. Look, you can see my belly button. Got a, I got a skin graft there, apparently. Well, now anytime I'm gone, I can still be here. What do you think about it? I kind of like it. Keeps me from missing you when you're gone. <laughs> <laughs> Inanimate That's... objects keep you company, huh? 
What's crazy about it is it's actual life size. Shut up. <laughs> Shut up. Just so people don't believe you. Oh, they'll believe this. No. I can carry you? I could take you for rides? Rock me like a baby. Oh. We can hang out. <laughs> How you been today, Trevor? Oh, that's cool. Now that you've seen this thing, what shall we print next? Let us know in the comments. Give us a like, subscribe, all that good stuff. And until next time, we'll see you next time. Nope. <laughs> I don't know how I feel about this. I'm not one for effigies. Don't know what that means, but okay. I have a feeling there's something bigger in the works. Tony. Bigger than that? It's a big printer. I heard George ordered a second one. <laughs>